Okay, in this short tutorial, we're going to tutorial we're going to continue on what we were doing before after creating place marks. What we want to do now is be able to add an image to our place mark so that when we click on the place, you will see uh, the associated image that you chose. All right. To start with, what we're going to do is I'm going to go to Google Images and I'm going to type in Austin, Texas, and these are some of the images that I have found in uh, Google Images. So what I'm going to do is when I hover over some of these images in Google Images, you will notice that um, there's a link down at the bottom of the description that says more sizes. I really like to go here because I want to be able to choose what size of image I want to put in Google Earth because if you use too big of an image, it's not going to look very well, look very good. So I'm going to click on more sizes and I'm going to see that same image in multitude of of sizes and if I scroll down I'm looking to see some smaller ones that 400 at 376 these probably look pretty good so I'm going to click on that image right there and I'm going to right mouse click it and I'm going to copy the image URL now this is instructions based on using Google Chrome um, if you right mouse click on Internet Explorer or Firefox you may have to find something that's slightly different um, but in this case, we're going to click on copy image URL. This is the direct web address for that image, not the page that it exists on, but the actual image itself. So I'm going to click on that. And then I'm going to go back to Google Earth and I'm going to right mouse click on my place mark, just like I did before, go to properties. And I have my description here, just like I did before. I'm going to place my cursor in the description, hit enter, and I'm going to click on add image. At that point, because I copied the image URL before, I'm going to right mouse click and click paste, and then I'm going to click OK. And you will see some gobbledygook right here, and it basically is just some HTML code that uses, that it needs in order to show the image. So once I have that, and I click OK, and then I click on Austin, Texas, you will see that the image is going to pop up right there. Now, if I had used a really large picture, the the, bu or the bubble would have just blown up enormous and it would have been a little unwieldy to look at. So that's why I like to get slightly smaller images for um, Google Earth. All right, so that's it for adding images.